All right, Pochita. Am I going to have to cover your eyes this entire episode? Hopefully. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Bus or I Shinobi. We have an episode five of our Chainsaw Man watch through called Gun Devil. It was a horrific cliffhanger at the end of the last episode. Denji about to get his promise on the deal he made with power. Three squeezes. His life goal right in front of him. And they just, they just cut to credits just like that. Let's find out. And hopefully this episode isn't too uncomfortable to watch with my child here. If you're new to the channel, drop us up and hit that big boy bell and let's get into it. Rose breathing? Well? <laughs> what? <the> <laughs> what? What? What that? What? Well, now two squeezes of actual boob. <laughs> That's one. <laughs> <laughs> the final fondling. Such splendorous things. There's a lot of stuff I could say, but huh? Bro is bricked up. Omega bricked up. His life changed forever with those squeezes. Let's see if uh, Denji can get over his, his blue balls. Oh, no, it's just gotten worse, I think. It's like inspired him even more to like get a girlfriend. Oh, my. Oh, he's like scarred. It's almost like, like I said, this is almost a bad thing that this happened. He's distracted. He's like a zombie. Chop. Also, the title of this episode is called Gun Devil. Did I bring that up? I was trying to come up with devils. Disposal. He's doing busy work. Bro, look at him! <laughs> She's like, what's up, Denji? You, you good? Oh, this is all for killing the bat devil. Oh my gosh. I'm not shocked that a lot would go into it. I kind of like this. Now he's trying to figure out what's next. Did it not live up? Wow. So that's why he's kind of shocked. His dream wasn't as much as he thought it'd be. Damn! It's like everything people were telling him was true. Or they said that's a stupid dream. I like how straight up he is with her. Oh. Oh. Should I be here? Bro's mesmerized. What is happening? Dude, she has him on a, a goddamn hook. Bro, why is my heart racing like this? <laughs> Gotta catch my breath, my god! <laughs> he was talking about <laughs> What is happening this episode? How are you in Magama? Dude, she is using him so hard! <laughs> 13 years ago in America. Classic! The gun devil in America. She literally does this and then she's like, alright, well, I have a mission for you. Go do it. Although he would have anyways, though. Any wish? Any wish? If you're Denji, Dude, he's on such a hook! He's so easy to manipulate. Gun dealers? Fuck, am I gonna be able to keep reacting to this show? Oh my god, this is getting hot and heavy. Major Alone tower? The country mouse and the city mouse. That's so cute. We're we gonna see the Gundam? Why did the subtitle color change? It's like blue or purple now. I'm colorblind, I don't know. Oh. Oh, dang. Boys will be boys. Oh, shoot. Where we're snowing. Aw, kid's so adorable. What? I'm supposed to play with you, man? 
talking about Pochita from Inside Denji is thinking right now. Oh. Rolled. Oh, man. Either one of these kids is a gun double or one of them's gonna die. There's just no in between. My God. I just, I didn't figure it out. It took me a second. I'm like, why are they showing these two innocent kids? And before rip. I like this this background music that's been going on during the episode. It's been going on since Booba session number two. So cozy. Oh, he wants to play with him. Now I'm guessing when this kid leaves, this kid dies by the gun devil. Or he is the gun devil. I don't know. It's literally just one or the other. I guarantee it. This is how this goes. Or his entire family is about to die. I didn't want to be right. <laughs> oh my god. Under five minutes, 1.2 million? That's from the gun devil? Bro, that's like apocalypse devil. What do you mean? What kind of gun is this? He's shooting like a cyclone? How do you even control that? Denji is on a goddamn mission now. For you, yes. He knows what's at stake now. Oh. Pieces of the gun devil? Oh, this is, this is bullets? I'm interested to see what this gun devil even looks like. Eh. Oh. 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 Hmm. Which just like becomes more and more of a giant just magnet leading to the gun devil. Aki! I forgot her name. She seems cool though. So I'll just searching for pieces of it. Get closer and closer to it. This poor kid, bro! Wait, that kid was Aki? Oh my. Did they say his name? I'm glad they showed that. If they had said his name and I just completely missed that, oh my god, people would have been so mad. How many pieces are they gonna need, though? Let's go, the crew! God, I thought the episode was about to end. I was so sad. The weeks passed so slow. So the devil in here only has a piece of it. I feel like this gun devil is gonna be like the overarching goal here. If it killed that many that quickly, bro. That's like way more than we've dealt with so far. They're sated by gum, bro. That's all it takes. Oh my god. Ah, 50 50 coin flip. I like Denji and Power as a duo more. Like I said, it just feels like Makima's just manipulating him. I think she is. But Power and Denji are too dumb together, man. Don't get right. Oh no, what prank? What was the prank? Oh, are they not gonna show it? Oh. Let's go! Denji's about it. Oh, he's about it too. Oh, maybe not. Maybe he's jealous. Decent. I like her vibe. She's cool. Denji! <laughs> Bro, he's realizing there's more to this world. Cause he said boob touch. He's like sex. He's like, oh, a kiss on the cheek. He's got one overarching goal. That's Makima. For her first kiss. I feel like Aki knows exactly who he's talking about. Yep. Oh, sex stops. A kiss on the cheek. I forgot her name, too, to be honest. <laughs> Bro, he's freaking out. <laughs> oh, my God. Man, strutting down this whole bricked up. Bro, this is... <laughs> This is the most dysfunctional group I've ever seen in my life. Himeno, that's her name. Well, him and Aki both really don't like Denji. Look how serious she is talking to Aki now. Because Arai is the guy. Kobeni. Yeah, she just seems timid. 
Surviving? I don't know. Power is crazy, but she seems really strong. Oh, that's... That's a worrying last line. Oh my gosh. Also, she and Aki know each other for a minute. Guessing so, is her, are her injuries from the gun devil as well? Mayhaps. Six. Damn. She's a cursed partner then. Oh. Ah, so that's the line she says to him. Is it, are the subtitles purple or whatever? Whenever it's a flashback? I think that's what that is. Yeah, it's gonna be a fat cliffhanger. I can just tell. Her eye patch is really cool. Like, it's really clean. Oh. What is that? It doesn't look that scary. I'm sorry, is she Darth Vader? She just has the force? Oh, they're looking for the bullet inside of it. God dang. She looks way too scared to be a devil hunter. The ghost devil? Served him What? Wait, that's sick. So it's supposed to be force. She uses a ghost? She has a ghost to act for her? That's cool. There's more. Dude, why was it just a head with feet, man? Why not? <laughs> oh, it's not powers? <laughs> She's like, what? You don't know? Maybe I'll betray you. Who knows? <laughs> oh my god, power. Stop! Oh, there's the ghost hand. That's a really cool power. That ghost kind of strong. Oh, you can't even fight back. Dang. <laughs> Denji. He's like, you got put in your place. I will devour you in time. Oh, wait, that's where they killed the other one. It's a maze. <gasps> Ooh, spooky. They're going to get split up or something. The unpleasant raw? What? What's this conversation in the background? Oh, they were already on the 8th floor, but they went up. Went back to the 8th floor. It's a labyrinth building. It's a trick building. They're all gonna get split up. Oh, no. It's kind of creepy, but I feel like all of them together can handle themselves. This is a strong group. My goodness gracious, that was a horny episode, to say the least. I thought we were get, gonna get the whole thing with power this episode, but Makima was one I didn't expect. But I, I can't help but just not like her dude like it feels like everything she does she's just using dingy as this tool and it's no different from from how the the last guy the mobster guy treated him but even the mobster guy was like more open about it like he even called dingy a dog well i guess she's called dingy a dog but like he's not leading him on or anything he's just like you're trash i use you that's the end of it she knows that he can't see past his goal of, of getting with a girl and she uses that to her advantage it just it feels so slimy man i think that's why i like power more yeah power is pretty unhinged but she She's genuine, at least. Especially because we saw all that with, like, her, a Meowie and everything and how she was genuine with that. Now she kind of came to admit her own mistake with that, especially. But we have this whole group together. We're getting to know these other Devil Hunters a lot more. And I'm guessing the entire next... I like how this episode set up for the next because a lot of them have been more standalone-esque situations. So that means next episode, we can just tackle this entire building and can be more of an overarching thing. But guys, that has been it for episode five of our Chainsaw Man watch-through. Do drop us up on the channel if you are new. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace, base.